Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Lag the Shit Out of My Computer, Rebellion. Okay, so, uh, Sins of the Solar Empire Rebellion as the Tech Loyalists. You all know the drill by now. Let's go find my fleet. To protect and serve! There we go. Book of Guns, the Titan. Oh wow, a single scout frigate. He is in for some pain. Research complete. Still, he looked pretty badass. He did look pretty badass. I assume that to be their home world. Which means we are what going now? to gather everyone up. Yes, sir. For a clusterfuck of a fight. This should be interesting. So Ready we have the battle. Fairy Goose. I know there is another capital ship in here if I can find it. Another one? Yep, the How can I be Jewel. of service? And Book of Guns about to siege an enemy's homeworld. Wow, that place could add a lot of stuff. Almost good to go. And, uh, fun fact, hopefully, I will uh, go order my graphics Our card tomorrow commander. if the snow eases up a little bit. Because I'll right now there is like fail. three foot of snow in my front garden. Research complete. All hands, prepare for phase jump. Now this should be an interesting fight, because they will not abandon their homeworld. Phase jump complete. Holy crap, there's nothing here. That is unusual. Either their fleet is away trying to secure them some someplace else, or they will... I have no idea what they're thinking. Either I have completely destroyed their fleet already, or they've left their homeworld completely undefended while my fleet was one jump away. I am honestly confuzzled. What do you want? Let's get him! I want that planet dead is what I want. Yeah, they have a single Gauss cannon as their planetary defense. And that's been like uh, destroyed right now. What's that? A refinery ship. Structure complete. This is pretty. Structure complete. Gotta feel sorry for the people on that planet. 
But there's nothing happening there, so no need to watch it. I've got the trade ports up and running. I do have one or two others, and so do my allies. And obviously the more you build, the more you upgrade your profits. And the more risk you run of a trade ship going through an enemy territory. And them stealing your profit. Aha, there's their fleet. Where is that? Halibus. Is that even mine anymore? No, it's not. It's, but I do have a badass space station there. I honestly have no idea what these guys are thinking. But whatever, we'll go with it. I mean, the only conceivable thing I can think of that they are planning to do is trying to lure me away from their homeworld by attacking one of my worlds. But I mean, that is the stupidest plan ever, because once I finish with their homeworld, then their fleets should, you know, be scuttled, because there's nothing left for them to defend. Allied backup has arrived. Well, whatever, we'll let them do their own thing and we'll do ours. Seeing as my world actually has, uh, my station actually has more health than their world right now. Yeah, once again, no idea what these guys were thinking. Structure complete. They deployed a siege platform to a planet that isn't mine. Genius. Yeah, they've got that. Well, the Starbase has that anyway. It's got that well under control. And their capital's about to go down. So it'll be interesting to see what happens when that goes. Because normally I play complete domination games. But for the sake of the let's play not having to uh, clear up are being attacked. and to show a different game mode, I went for Capital, which I didn't actually play beforehand. So it'll be nice to see what happens. I wouldn't care, the greens would have been nice and safe if they'd left me to go after the purples for a while. They could have built up some pretty strong defences. We have obliterated an enemy's capital. Nice. So, does that mean their fleet disappears? It appears not. But their fleet is just about gone anyway. Ah, well, right now they are still technically capable of trying for a counter-attack to get back the capital. A 
It must suck to be that guy right now, the Ultimus. Okay, so that was lovely. Orbital refineries. You gotta love them. They will travel to any system of mine and uh, grab resources that are lying around. More crystal is needed. Allied forces are being attacked. So that was an interesting start. It looks like the yellows pretty much have the uh, greens on the uh, the purples on the ropes again, but this is a uh, a continual pattern of theirs. I doubt it's going to last forever. Planet development finished. Well, let's see. Let's um. Do I have a scout or anything? Comlink active. Really? No one leveled up. To protect and serve. Okay. So let's uh, let's go to diplomacy. That should tell us. Yes, they have the shattered screen, so they are gone. They are out of the game. But it seems like their old structures are still around, so we will still have to clear them out from any planets we want to take. So the units don't automatically implode, which is kind of nice, actually. Allied backup has arrived. Planet development finished. Allied backup. A single Seeger vessel. How generous. On the plus side, we are about to find out what's on these planets. Nothing. <laughs> Not a damn thing. Okay, research. Let's go get me a super cannon. I doubt I'll build it, but it's just nice to have it there. Forces are being attacked. Give the order. I got point. Planet development finished. So I think next I'm going to focus on the purples once I've cleaned up the greens, if the yellows don't finish them off. Because I mean the purples have what, one, Allied two, three, backup four, has four, arrived. five planets. Is that really an unclaimed dwarf planet? I think nobody wants that. <laughs> oh no, the yellows and the purples are fighting over it. Structure complete. I thought that was a bit odd. Ready to move out! No enemy will get by us. Really? Because so far, like, every enemy that's passed through the system has just waltzed straight by you. Plotting jump coordinates. All hands, prepare for phase jump. But Diverting still. power to jump engines. Phase you, jump you do that. complete. Two seconds. Okay, crisis averted. All is right in the, the world. The price on our head has increased. 
And uh, that's been like two seconds for you. It's been like 45 minutes for me, so. Planet Just give me a minute finished. here. Ah, yes, that's right. We are storming this tiny little dwarf planet. Because the green's complete. got messed up. Allied forces are being attacked. More crystal is needed. We need more meth. Our orders, Commander. Blow shit up. There's your orders. Now then. <clears throat> so, let's see here. The yellows are still. Taking apart these purples piece by piece. Very, very slowly. Looks like they keep stalling on the home world. And then coming back with a fresh wave. And then dying. And come back with a fresh wave. And it seems to be a never ending cycle. On the plus side, they are Structure taking complete. worlds. Albeit slowly. We have wiped out an enemy colony. A yeah, new we do colony that a lot. has been founded. Research complete. Allied backup has arrived. Oh, this can't be nice for them. But we got a new trade, trade hope, so that's cool. I'm gonna sell a bunch of metal because we always have far too much of it. Oh wow. That thing is more powerful than I thought it was. It's basically got the same weapons as a Starbase. Structure nice. complete. Let's have a good look at the map here and assess the situation. Props to anyone who gets that reference. Planet development. Oh wow, so it looks like the greens are like demolishing these oranges over here. It looks like we are winning all around. We are full of win. Allied forces are being attacked. Yeah, them greens are the ones with the Titan. So that's why they're pushing back the enemy so easily. And it's the Titan I had in the last Let's Play. The one that looks like an umbrella fleet has arrived. that's been left out in the wind and lost its, you know, the fabric part. So that's nice. Titans all around. Apart from the yellows who are really, really, really bad at their job. Because they keep letting the Research enemy build complete. more capital ships. sure they have and I'm also sure I do not care need repairs not at all yes I need yes, that planet destroyed so let's hands. see how this Prepare goes for phase jump Another pretty much empty planet. I think there's like a single colony ship here. And a few small buildings. Let's see, did anyone level up yet? Level one. Ready level for four. battle. Congrats. A friendly fleet has arrived. Uh, let's go with more Gauss. Because that's always fun. Anti globalization. 
Where do you need me? And the teasing jewel. Let's get you better target and uplink so you can help everyone else do more damage. Oh, wow, there was a flak burst, I think. Allied backup has arrived. Stupid chair keeps getting stuck. A friendly fleet has arrived. Wow, I'm pretty sure Book of Guns just farted on a trade port. Yes, he did. How marvelous is that? This is my new favorite Titan. I'm sorry, but any Titan that farts on buildings, that, that's, uh, that's awesome. Allied forces are being I know attacked. every Titan has a powerful rear weapon. Allied backup has arrived. Or at least all the Titans I've used, I've only used like two or three of them. A friendly fleet has arrived. Will you seriously take out their capital ship factory? You would save yourself so much trouble if you did that. Oh, they're gonna let them get away. Yellow AI sucks. No, then, no, then. Let's, uh, increase our fleet capacity. How can I be of service? You can wait there until you have the antimatter to colonize this place. In fact, you have like crap Who all antimatter. And I don't you want to sit around commander. waiting for you to be done, so. A friendly fleet has arrived. Dun, 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 dun. Sorry if you can hear the little uh, kids in the background. I think I'll pause Diverting that while they show up. Diverting power to jump engines! Plotting okay, jump so, uh, coordinates. This video is going to be cut into more pieces than a Jack the Ripper victim. In fact, he did not cut his victims into pieces. That was terrible. All hands, prepare just, uh, for phase jump. Just forget that one. Okay. And boom. transmission received. He's going to take forever to get there. In fact, the game might be over by the time he gets there. A friendly fleet has arrived. Diverting power to jump engines. I should hope so, seeing as you're trying to jump. This guy's not the brightest tool in the shed, is he? And yes, I realize I mixed a bunch of different things together. Six of those, couple of those, couple of those. All hands, prepare for phase jump. Allied backup has arrived. A friendly fleet has arrived. What now? Yes, sir. Next, we move on. Allied what is forces are being attacked. One away from the last green planet. Research complete. That'll be fun. And we can finally start building this other little fleet here. If you're wondering what that is, it is a siege frigate. It's meant for taking Allied out star bases. Arrived. I expect the oranges to be better prepared than these greens. Otherwise, I will turn the difficulty right up to hard for the last enemy and make them go insane.
Let's clear this place out. Was it just me or did that guy sound Scottish? Rosh, why are you face jumping to Rosh Alarm? Did I set? Oh, I must have set that as their waypoint. A friendly fleet has arrived. Let's clear this place out. Yeah, he sounds distinctively Scottish. Allied forces are being attacked. Our orders, Commander. Planet development finished. A friendly fleet has arrived. Diverting power to jump engines! Okay, and here we go. Over Let's to the next random out. nameless planet that I'm never gonna use again. All hands, prepare for phase jump. Well, that is a lot of uh, refinery drones. Let's do something about that. Our orders, Commander! Namely, blow up the refinery, which is the cause of them all. Because my ships will stupidly go after the refinery drones instead of the refinery. Let's clear this place out. Nice, so, uh... A friendly fleet has arrived. Allied backup has arrived. Eh, my culture is overthrowing this planet anyway. That's nice. Our backup is joining the fight. Where do you need me? Uh, Phase jump complete. That house. These missiles won't fire themselves. Actually, that's kind of exactly what a missile does. A friendly fleet has arrived. Nothing much too interesting going on there. It's a, is there just like one Ogro torpedo thing there? Let's clear this place out. Allied backup has arrived. Okay, so they're, they're marching. They're just taking their time about it. Let's give you a good look at these things so you can see why they're going so slow. There is this huge thing powered by those dinky Behold engines. My creations. And on the front are huge missiles. And I mean like so forces are being attacked. Like the length of this ship nearly. Huge, huge missiles. Let's see. A friendly fleet has arrived. Ah, well. We will probably colonize this place soon. But there is only one green planet left, so that's that's good. Allied backup has arrived. Let's see, how are the yellows doing? Oh, they've actually assembled a half decent force here. I did not expect that.
a friendly fleet has arrived. And they have an exceptionally strong force for the yellows. Destroying this asteroid. I'm not sure what's got into them. They've been proficient all of a sudden. Our backup is joining the fight. Allied backup has arrived. Well, the greens are gone. The yellows are on the way out. So I think... Uh, oh, wow. The oranges are on the way out if this battle goes in the greens' favour. Which it looks like it already decidedly is in the greens' favour. A friendly fleet has arrived. You know, I think we will... I was going to end this episode off here. But I think we will... Uh, backup has arrived. Get to the end of this episode this time. Because once the capital's gone, a eh, an enemy loses all... Oh, looks like he's lost control of that planet. An enemy loses all of his coordination. And it basically becomes a bunch of small militia groups. From what I can tell. Because none of the green planets help each other out. None of them had any a friendly fleet has arrived. military to speak of. Air wing at your disposal. And none of them really built any military. Even though they had the capabilities. Yep, Aster Thurl defeated. That'll be the oranges. So now there is only the purples left. Victory! So, oh, military victory! We win! Oh, handlebar mustache and bro shades. Why are you kids wearing helmets? Well, whatever. That brings this let's play to an end. Kind of shorter than I thought it would be. But it's a Attacking good uh, an empire has become more profitable. It was a good game. I enjoyed it. I will keep playing this for a while. Not like this game, but you know, on my own. A friendly fleet has arrived. Uh, I'm not sure what's coming up next. I think I will wait until I have my graphics card, which, like I said, as long as the snow doesn't come pouring down again today, I will go and get tomorrow. And then I have a whole treasure trove of games on Steam that I cannot play yet. So I will see you when I see you. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.